just have to do it like this. What up, though, everybody? It's your girl, Miss Mella from Detroit. I said I wasn't going to say that anymore. But anyway, this is your girl, Miss Mella from Detroit. And I am about to do... I'm about... That's so horrible language. I'm about to do the um, Kool-Aid pie. Yeah. Yep, the Kool-Aid pie. Anyway, I just got home from church, you guys. And I said the first thing I was going to do is I was going to do this Kool-Aid pie. So, I know you probably can't see me. Um, I have... Great Kool-Aid. So I have great Kool-Aid. And I have Cool Whip. And I have condensed milk. Right? And I have my bow. And I hope this bow is big enough because this is a smaller thingy. Oh, let me go on my refrigerator and get my pie shell. So, I actually have two pie shells. Here's one. Let me show you guys the other one. And here's the other one. But I'm only going to do one because the other one I am going to use, um, I'm going to use cream cheese. And I'm, I'm doing one without cream cheese and I'm doing, I'm doing one with cream cheese and i'm doing one without cream cream cheese this one i'm about to do now is the one without the cream cheese and i hope it turned out right and i'm not going to um tomorrow i'll come back and let you guys know how it tastes and stuff like that and i don't have a can opener so I don't have a can opener. This don't work, trust me. But anyway, we just go put like a little slit in this in this can. Then I'm gonna take a knife, ghetto style. I need to go out and bend one, but I'm gonna take a knife and I am going to open. Take a knife. So if you guys don't know how to open up a can with a knife, you take your can opener that really don't work. And you take a knife, right? And because this is pretty much liquid, you don't have to open it all the way. Oh, that shit is sweet as fuzznuck. So, what I'm about to do is I'm about to hook up this pie. I'm going to put it in the refrigerator right now. It's like 3.35. I just got home from church. So, I'm about to hook up this pie. Y'all about to watch me. And I hope this is good enough. This bowl, I hope this bowl is good enough. But if not, and I'm using gray. I want an orange because orange is my favorite color. And let me tell you, I got this Kool-Aid from Audi's. I got the um, condensed milk from Audi. I don't know where my daughter bought the Cool Whip from. Um, and I got the... From Dollar Tree. I got the graham cracker thing from Dollar Tree. And I actually want to put this back in the refrigerator until I'm ready to pour it. Into my bowl. Only because I want it to I want the graham cracker crush to be cold. So when I pour it in there. It could be cold and it won't be sitting out and warm and stuff. So I just want my ass to be a little cold. So what I'm going to do, first I'm going to take out a pack of Kool-Aid. Okay, I really wish you guys can see me, but hey, it's cool. Take out a pack of Kool-Aid. I'm going to pour some milk in the bowl like so. And I know this stuff is so, so sweet. I'm not really a sweet person. I really don't care for sweets like that. But we're going to pour that in there. I don't want to use all of it. But take my gum. Thought I, got my, I might have to use all of it. But if I don't use all of it, I'll still have some for later. For my other one anyway. So... Now, 
I'm going to take my Kool-Aid. And I know I'm doing mine a little different. I just like to do stuff different. Take my Kool-Aid, pour some Kool-Aid in there. I still got some more Kool-Aid in the pack. And I'm just going to stir the Kool-Aid and, and the condensed milk together first. I don't know why I'm doing this, but this is what I'm doing. So now I'm going to take my Cool Whip. It's, cool, it's a Cooler Whip. Ugh, this shit is so disgusting. But y'all see it's the small one. This is the um eight ounce. It's small, but we're gonna take the cool whip and we're going to dump the cool whip into in this bowl. And I had bought these bowls um yesterday. Because I don't really have no bowls. I got like small cereal bowls and stuff like that. But I don't really have any bowls like that. Then we're going to take the rest of our Kool-Aid and we're going to pour it. Bam. Now we're going to just mix. We're going to use this and we're going to stir and mix and stir and mix. Yeah, it's pretty simple. It's pretty simple. Yeah, I'm gonna do another one too. I'm gonna show y'all the other one that I'm gonna do tomorrow. I have I was watching this girl. I don't even know her name. I don't even know if I subscribe to her channel, but I could always go back, you know, and check it out. But um yeah, I seen this girl, she because she said she didn't, she's not a whipped cream person. So she did, she used, um, um, what's the stuff called? Cream cheese. I'm going to use cream cheese on one of them. The other one, the other pack of Kool-Aid I have is like a, a strawberry or a cherry. Let me see what flavor. I got everything in my refrigerator. I don't know why. But the other pack is, yeah, it's um, cherry flavor. So the cherry flavor I'm going to do tomorrow, and this one I'm doing right now. Excuse, y'all have to excuse me. Like I said, I just came home from church, and I knew this was the first thing I was going to do because we need this to sit. I'm I'm gonna have it to sit overnight anyway. You know they say six hours. It's three forty now. I know that I'm not going to get back on the camera and stuff. So well, my phone. But yeah, so we're just going to mix this all up together. Don't worry about my hands, you guys. I washed my hands before. Uh, um, so. And this grape, it's grape. I guess it's grape. And you can see like the little Kool-Aid. At least I can see the Kool-Aid. And I know you have to mix it real, real good, right? So I'm mixing it real good. Let me let me give it a little taste, taste. Mmm. Oh. Oh, that Kool-Aid flavor is bomb. And I'm just gonna add just a little more of this because it's sweet, but I just wanted a little sweeter. And you can taste the Kool-Aid with the tartness you know, of the great Kool-Aid, but it's good. So this is it, you guys. You know, you just stir it, you know. And it all fits in the bowl, thank you, Jesus. Because everything fits in this little bowl. So that's a good thing, huh? And it this, this really doesn't take that long. And I don't really need like a blender or nothing like that and stuff so yeah because uh, only because see this is the see this is the small too i've been using i've been seeing people use like the bigger one this is small so i can do this in this small bug oh yeah so it's looking it's looking grapey it's looking good let's give it another little taste Mm. 
Oh, that's about to be bomb when it fucking frees up. Well, not freeze up, but, you know. So, yeah. Ooh, excuse me. Sorry, you guys. I just passed a little gas. No worries. I'm only here by myself. So, I hope everybody's staying safe. Y'all know that coronavirus going out. Oh, the word today. Mm, mm, mm. Um, so... Now I'm going to take my pie crust out and yeah, take my pie crust out. I'm gonna take it out. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I hope you guys went to church and praised the Lord. Okay. I hope you guys are staying safe from the corona and you know not doing too much extra stuff or whatever you know so hey so so now what we're going to do is dump it in this right here i had this in the refrigerator because i want it to be cool you know and stuff like that so now we're just going to put the pie well not the pie but you know the stuff the whipping into our pie can our pie thingy right this is ooh and you guys you know what i actually thought that this um with this little bowl i didn't think it was going to be enough with this little bowl even though it's small, I thought it was going to be, you know, more. And I thought it wasn't going to be so much um, of this stuff. You know, the stuff. <laughs> but, yeah. So, we're just going to smooth it like so. This is so fun. I am so enjoying this. This is so fun. I, th I think I want to do the cream cheese one too. But we're just going to do this like so. Right? We want it to look kind of decent, you know. So I have no fruit or anything to put on top of it. So it doesn't really matter. But yeah. So we're going to do this. But like I was saying, so... The word today at my church was awesome. And it's always awesome. Okay? Don't worry about my hands. They are clean. Um, it's also always awesome. But, but, you know, it was talk about, you know, Jesus coming. He's angry at a lot of us. You know? He's angry. You know, we have to do right and stuff like that. This right here is a test. See how faithful you are. It's a test. So, you guys, here's my pie. All right? Ta-da! And this is great. Can you guys tell? I, I put one whole pack in, but, you know, hey. So, now we are going to put this on top. I'm gonna put this on top and close it up and we're going to check it tomorrow we're going oh I gotta go to church service tomorrow too I do have to go to service tomorrow that ain't until six this evening so I can you know check it but if I happen to go to the grocery store later on, I will get me some fruit, maybe some grapes or something to put on top. Or something, since this is great. So, here it is, you guys. And thank you for watching this video. Oh, well, anyway, this is the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching this video. And I will see you guys when I... 
do my taste test. Bye. Have a blessed night. What up, do everybody? It's your girl, Miss Mello from Detroit. So this is the second half of my video, but um, I'm just going to combine the videos together so it can just be one. So I did a, a um, grape Kool-Aid pie yesterday, and I just kept it in the refrigerator overnight. Um, I made it about three something yesterday and now it's about 12 52 almost one o'clock so yeah let's cut this cake this pie open and see what it do because i was so excited when i did this i swear i was so excited i was like i would do these pies all the time and this you know what it's a good idea for like um easter you know because the colors and stuff so I'm gonna take this lid off and I'm gonna show you guys how my pie look mmm it was it's, it smells good this is how my pie look this is great flavor so we're going to cut into this bats boy oh oh okay now y'all I don't really care for I'm gonna do a small piece Cause I don't really care and I cannot cut worth nothing, but I don't really care for like just regular whipped cream, but mm, here's the pie. Here's the pie. Let me put you guys on pause for one. You know what? Never mind. Anyway, here's the pie. So now we're about to taste the pie. I'm just going to cut a piece. And we're going to taste this pie. Mmm. Mmm. That is good. Babe, you want to taste this? Love tea. This pie is so delicious. Oh, my word. I just cut a small piece, y'all. But this pie is good. And you want to know something? I'm not a big fan. I'm not a big fan of whipped cream. But it's actually delicious. It really is actually delicious. Oh, I can't believe this pie turned out like this. I can't believe it. I've been seeing people. Actually, I've seen Beloved. She made like probably seven of them. She did all the colors looking so nice and pretty. So I wanted to do an orange since orange is one of my favorite flavors. And they didn't have orange Kool-Aid. Hmm. Mm. Mm hmm So I got grape and cherry. Now the cherry one that I'm going to do, I'm going to do a cherry one. But it's going to have cream cheese in it. Now, I've seen this girl. I do not know her name. But she used cream cheese in hers. Uh, uh -huh. mm. Excuse my ghettoness with the knife. But I just wanted to come out here. So... I can taste the pie with you guys. This is so damn good. I only cut a small piece because, look, oh, y'all see that? Mm, mm, mm. Just imagine, the cheesecake one gonna be even better. I know that. The cheesecake one is going to be even better. We gonna put these little crumbs that's on here that fell off. See. Mm. That is pretty delicious. How oh. that's pretty much damn that's good. That's pretty much the end of this. So I'm gonna do the other one later on on camera. I'm gonna post this up. Um if you haven't seen my um, 
my haul video. You can go check that video out. It's up now. Um, it's a um, budget haul video. Clothes, you know, a couple of outfits for, for the Lolo. So, um, yeah, if you haven't seen that video, you can go check that video out. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Leave any questions in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Yeah, that's about pretty much it. I will see you guys in my next video. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like and give a comment. It's not that hard to do, you know? It's not really hard to do. But these, this pie is freaking bomb. Like, this pie is so... Oh, my word. It is so good. I, can, I can't wait to do the cream cheese one with the cream cheese because I think it's going to be even better. But anyway, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Leave any detailed messages down below in the comment section. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.